Hey guys, what's up? So I want to show you quickly how to uh, lock down your computer if you are uh, working on something and you have a uh, and there's kids around your home and uh, they come over and you're working and uh, sometimes they come and they start tapping on the keyboard or, or moving the mouse and they mess up your work. So I'm gonna show you how to lock down the computer quickly just with a click uh, the first thing first thing uh, you want to do is uh, open google okay here on google you're going to type toddler keys it's a small program um, on the first result download.com you're going to click on that there is toddler keys you're going to download it once you have downloaded the program and you have installed it here on the windows uh, taskbar where the notification area is you're gonna see this icon right here with a T and a K. So you're gonna see that and you're going to right click. And um, on this uh, menu, you're going to select either lock the keyboard or lock both the keyboard and the mouse. Uh, this is to lock the CD drive or the DVD drive, drive whatever. And this is to disable the power button in case the, the kid uh, pushes the power button, he's not going to be able to turn off the computer. Um, so this is where you're going to just with one click disable both the keyboard and the mouse. And right here on the left hand corner of the screen, you want to see this text box. Uh, is telling you uh, the other keys has locked your keyboard and mouse. Type quit to unlock them. So when you're ready to uh, access the keyboard and the mouse again, you're going to type quit. Uh, once you type it, the program should sound. Uh, in case your computer has a touch screen, this is not going to disable the touch screen. Uh, you're going to have to disable that manually. So what you're going to do is uh, open the, the uh, Windows Explorer window. Um, and on the first arrow right here, you're going to click it and you're going to scroll down to uh, Control Panel. Uh, this is Windows 10. On the Windows 8, I believe, Control Panel is still available on the Start menu. Um, so. Once you are here on the at the control panel, you're going to type device manager. You want to click on that. Okay. Uh, right here uh, on the device manager, you're going to scroll down to human interface devices. Click on the arrow, the arrow, and uh, you're going to scroll down to HID compliant to screen. You want to right click it and you're going to select disable device which is the second choice right here. Um, I already have it disabled that is why it's asking me if I want to enable it. But you're going to click disable. Uh, if you restart the computer it's possible that it's going to activate the touch screen again so you need to uh, keep that in mind because uh, the the drivers sometimes uh, reinstall themselves, so that that depends on uh, your computer. So that's pretty much it. Uh, hopefully that helps. And uh, thanks.